Hey love bugs, it's Riles and back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hopeful saying for you. If this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. And for my returning subs, thank you so much for the love and support and the kind words you bless me with each and every day. And so, namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you're comfortable enough to drop me a line, I would love the chance to get to know you or it's just about the content of my video or about your gift. It would be greatly appreciated. Or if you feel like you resonate with my video and enjoy it, please give me a thumbs up, like, and even share. I would appreciate that also. So thank you for stopping by my channel and coming to see about me today. And today my meditation music is Pure Clean Positive Energy Vibration and meditation music for healing, relaxing mind, body, and soul. And I will place that in the link, the, place the link in the description box below. And my video is about Twin Flame 101, Heyoka's dealing with strange events. Like the last video I just put you out, put out for yesterday. The ones talking about seize the moment, it took me three times to upload. Like, something didn't want me telling y'all that truth. Like, something was really trying to block me from that. Either my my computer kept updating and knowing it was set for like two weeks, prior, you know, two weeks later on to be uploaded. But yet, you know, it kept cutting off or, you know, it kept slowing down. You know, it was like right towards the end and kept on sticking. So, it was just like, I was determined like, oh no, I'll just, you know do a new tab and start it back over again because that truth really needed to come out and I noticed that happened to me two days in a row so it's just like it's really been crazy on these you know these strange events I don't know with you being an empath you know dealing with your purge or you dealing with your spiritual awakening you're dealing with kundalini or any kind of ascension um side effects you know um and it's like it's since since I've released a lot of stuff and you know, felt empty inside, it's like lately I've been getting energy that's really gravitating towards me. It's like, especially if it's people that I talk to, like on a daily basis or every other day, if they're affected, I will feel that. And it, it can even be, you know, they wouldn't even have to tell me, I'll just call and check on them like, hey, are you okay? Are you dealing with something right now? And then it's just like, they'll go off telling me. And it's just like, I'm sitting there like, is this really happening? this really happening I can be thinking about my dad so I can send me a picture like right after that and it's just like it's feeling so surreal so I'm just wondering is this happening for you I mean are you blowing light bulbs it's just like you're hearing you know it, it's just like I'm hearing that if you're a youtuber with all the you know the eclipse and stuff that's going on it's going to start messing with electronics and mine's is already starting to mess up like i can have a video uploaded and i make sure you guys get it you know love bugs get it every morning at a certain time and then i knew i said to get that time but next thing you know i turn around and look it'll be for the next you know the day after it was supposed to be set for it'll be messing me up so i'm just like what the heck is going on so it's just like really, really, really crazy, and it, I'm just really trying to understand this. Like, what is going on? What kind of? Why are these strange events happening? Why am I blowing, you know, electronics or you know the light bulbs are you know blowing a lot in front of me? They usually don't, since it's energy shift. You know, I'm just wondering about that. You might get constant headaches. It just feels like my forehead, and you know, my forehead's cracking half the time. You know, the, the dreams finally calm down. You know, it's just being an empath. We have intense dreams. Or you'll just be awake in the middle of the night between 3 and 5 a.m. You know, it's just like really crazy. And I'm just wondering, am I the only one who's going through this right now? You know, drop me a line and let me know. I would love to know that I'm not dealing with this by myself. You know, so it's just like when spirit guides tell me, you know, with your experience that you go through, let them know. You know, be able to express what you're going through. You know, be able to help others along the way. Be able to guide them towards that light. And, I mean, I enjoy that. It doesn't seem like it's a duty to me. It doesn't seem like an honor. I would step in and just help people. And, you know, people would be just like, you know, you just do that for me. And I'm just like, you know, if I know this is coming from a good intention, I know you're not trying to play me, I have no problem going to bat for you if I know it's coming from a good place. You know, and I you now it's just like before I wasn't able to really fill that out, and now I am. So it's just like before, you know, being an empath or 
Telco, whatever, you have probably came across people that you have extended your hand out like more than you probably did another person, and then you end up getting back sad. And you're just looking like, hold up, you know, why did this happen to me? Why am I going through that? And it was just like, it was meant for you and this person to have some kind of lesson that had come across your past. So it was, you know, it's kind of, it's kind of like a cruel, kind situation. If I hope you can understand, <laughs> because it's kind of hard to explain. Because sometimes I get stuck myself, and it's just like you have to be a little cruel to be kind and stuff like that. But you have to learn from every experience that you go through. So it's just like now, since all these occurrences have been happening, and I'm looking at them in a different perspective, in a different light. You know, coming out with positive solutions to a negative situation where sometimes it would seem like a freaking, you know, Japanese arithmetic or some kind of matrix, uh, what is it, Neo Morpheus kind of situation where you're just looking like, okay, did I miss something? This is way too deep and whatever my head. But now it's just like, oh, okay, I got it. So I'm just wondering, is anybody else going through these situations? Please drop me a line. Let me know. Hit me up. I would love to hear from you as much as you're hearing from me. And if you resonate with this video, please give me a thumbs up and like and even share you know hit the notification bell you know like and subscribe it will greatly be appreciated you know you stay safe i know this is weekend have fun unwind but be responsible for everything you do send out as much love and positivity as possible and i will check you out on my next video and i will keep doing my prayers and i hope you definitely do the same for me so i will see you on my next video peace and be wild